So you're given a list of points, and you're asked to make the equation of a line. What does that mean? That means find the regression equation. So the first step you do is you hit stat on your calculator, then edit, enter the data, all the points that we just saw. Once it's all in, you put in all the x's at once, then you hit the right arrow, and then go and put all the y's. You hit stat, calc. Now some calculators, you have to do choice four for linear regression, choice six if you want to do a quadratic, and choice zero if you want to do exponential. So this is the linear, so you do choice four. Then we hit calculate. Once we have calculate, you're going to have this on your screen. And the answer, everywhere you see an A, you put a 5. Everywhere you see a B, you put a 7 for this specific example. So Y equals 5X plus 7. So here, let's take a look at it on the calculator. You hit the stat. Edit is already there, so you just hit enter or choice 1. I've already entered the data, but you can see if I enter in one more point down here, I can do 5, hit enter, and then right arrow, since it's the last one, let's say 5, and the next point is 8. Now that all the data is entered, you hit stat again, calc, choice 4 for linear regression, choice 6 for a cubic, choice 5 for a quadratic, and choice 0 for an exponential. So this one is said find the line of best fits, so that's linear. Go all the way down to calculate and hit enter. Now I already had my diagnostics turned on, so my R number, my correlation coefficient, is 0.55, rounded to 0.59. That is not a good line of best fit, okay? So this is not a good fit. Closer to 1, closer to negative 1 is a good fit. And that's how you find the equation of the line.